Hello everyone, this is Nicholas with Owl Homes of Fredonia. And today we are checking out the latest modular home addition to our campus down here in Fredonia, New York. This home is a three bedroom, two bathroom home, has a beautiful master suite. It's about 1500 square feet of living space, has a beautiful walk-in pantry, features a recessed entry area, and the curbside bump out package with the dormer over them. So this is a twin peak dormer over the one bump out. And you can actually see that bump out inside the home. It does add space to the rooms. And this is a single peak dormer over the second bump out here. This is the master bedroom here. So I'm gonna do a quick walk around of this house and show you the back as well. We're out here in lovely Fredonia, New York. 3752 East Main Road, Fredonia, New York. Not far at all off the throughway, just down the road. Here we have the back of the home. There is a transom window off of the walk-in pantry. And we have some French doors off of the nook. And you can see the leaves are changing or falling already. And we have the side door for the utility room here. By the way, we have so many homes here to see. We've got that big, tall two-story behind that ranch home there. We've got another modular ranch home here. That is an 1,800 square foot, 512 roof pitch manufactured home. And it is beautiful. You gotta check that out. Come on in and check it out or watch the video tour that I have on YouTube. But today, we are focusing on this new modular home. So let's get on inside. And black front door, it's beautiful. Um, don't normally see this, got the keypad on there. Really nice front door entryway here. Let's get you inside. Okay. Really spacious in here. I'll show you this entryway that we just came into. So. Very nice to have this separated. So the, the door is black on the outside and white on the interior. It has a nice little uh, light there coming in. And yeah, nice keypad here as well. And here is the guest closet. And they wrapped all the doors in plastic in this house, keeping nice and clean. So that's great. So there we have a coat closet. And we were able to fit a really big couch in here. A lot of space in here. Got the chef's range hood vent over the stove here. Beautiful option. And can't beat the backsplash at all. So here we have the walk-in pantry. This is amazing and I would love to have this. It's got a light in there as well as a transom window for natural light. So I'll walk in here. And these are those, these are much bigger than the closet uh, shelving. They, they, these are a lot further out. So a lot, of, a lot of space on these. I would assume that that's a couple feet. Each shelf is like a couple feet from the wall to the end of the shelf. So big pantry and taken up by a lot of shelving. So tons of storage in here. We have cabinets everywhere, even hidden behind here. And they are very, very functional. You have the uh, racks in here to adjust the shelving however you'd like them to be. Everything is soft close. And I'm sorry about the focus there. Whirlpool appliances. 
and this is a beautiful chef spring faucet. Nice big cabinets in this house. And of course the French door. So we can open this thing up safely to the outside. So another view of the interior here. Big living space. Definitely most of this home is living space here. And we're gonna save the master, which is over there for last. I'm gonna bring you back into this hallway and bring you back to the secondary bedrooms and bathroom. And it's nice to have some separation here off the living area. You can come to this end of the home and be separated from the main living area. So this is bathroom number two, full bathroom. Nice inlaid sinks. So the countertop goes straight to the sink. And a little upgrade on the backsplash there as well. And here we have the standard tub shower combo. So this is what pretty much comes standard in nearly every home, unless you change it to something else. So here we have bedroom number two, and this has the bump out off of it, the first bump out that you saw outside. So you can see this actually does bump out on the inside as well, creates a nice look, and uh, about six in extra inches of space right here. And there's a little bit of curvature to these rooms, so they definitely have some character to them. And these secondary bedrooms are a good size. And pretty wide closets as well. They go pretty far to the left and right. Okay, so bringing you over here. Um, here we have the utility room, bath, uh, bedroom number three, and this here is your basement drop. So this would go down into the basement of the home. We'd build the steps straight down there, and you can see the ductwork and everything that needs to be installed um, on site in this home. So furnace, hot water tank, ductwork plumbing lines, gas lines, all that stuff would be installed on site in this home. So let's take you to bedroom three here. This one seems just a touch smaller than the other one, but they're still a good size in this house compared to some that we see. And the closets are a decent size as well. This one's actually more like a mini, mini walk-in. You can walk right into this one. And lastly, on this side of the home, we have a beautiful utility room with a uh, utility sink there and matching backsplash to the bathroom. And this is another storage closet here that we have a bunch of stuff in, it looks like. So a pretty deep closet there. We just have it filled up with stuff. We have the 200 amp electrical panel. So lots of space left on that panel. Plenty of power to these homes. Feel free to be able to also install a garage and have adequate power to that. And here is the utility sink and storage underneath it, which is nice. Actually, okay, yeah, of course, that's a hidden drawer or a, a fake. For aesthetics, actually, you can see how deep it goes into there, so that makes sense. But these are functional on the bottom, so nice big open space there, and can't beat the soft close. There you have it. And full washer dryer set up right here. Of course, side door to just a second entryway or future attached garage, even. And working the rest of the way back to the master. Nice 
nice shop right there. Very big island in this house. And last but not least, we have the master bedroom. And you can see the second bump out on the home is right here. Creating some good, a good look for this room. And last, we're gonna see the master bathroom. has a lot of storage, double lap sink. Okay, those are all aesthetic and plenty of storage below. And of course, everybody's favorite option, rightfully so, the four by six tiled shower that we definitely have to get inside of. Very nice, beautiful tiles in here. Everything looks pretty nice in here. Oh, very heavy door and it slides very nicely. Oh, and it shuts. You can even feel it kind of shut. Oh yeah, that's very quality. And finally, master closet. We have a nice big walk-in closet here in the master bathroom. And that is the entire home. Thank you so much for watching the video. And realistically, if you wanted a doorway to go into the closet from the bedroom, you could we could order the home that way. So you have an option there if you don't want the doorway from the bathroom into the closet. Once again, thanks so much for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed this home. Like and subscribe and we'll keep pumping out these home video tours as we've been, as we've been doing for a while now. Leave a like, a comment, tell us what you think. And if you'd ever like some information on these homes, you can reach out to us at All Homes of Fredonia. And a consultant would be glad to help you with any information that you need. We make it extremely easy to get information on these homes, the price of them, the site work included in the home, and what it could approximately cost, lender recommendations, pretty much anything you need. We just try to make it as easy as possible, get people to the point where they have enough information so that they could buy a home if they wanted to, and pretty much just leave it at that and let you make the decision from there. 3752 East Main Road, Fredonia, New York, 14063. And our phone number is 716-673-1366. Feel free to reach out and stop in anytime. We're here Monday through Friday, 9 to 5, and Saturday, 9 to 4. Thanks so much again for watching, and have a great weekend.